Hi, in this video today I'm going to show you how to publish and share a Word project locally. Okay, so now here, let's get started. In this video, I will guide you how to share the Azure project on the IIS, Community Internet Information Services. Okay, close this one. And this is the Azure project I'm working on. Assuming I have finished design for this. So now I want to be deliver this one to my customer. Okay. I will firstly I will open my browser and I type in the local hot. Enter. Okay. So here firstly I need to check the installation of the internet information services on my PC. When you type in localhost on the browser, if you see this page, that means you have been you have successfully installed the Internet Information Services on your PC. Otherwise, if you didn't see this page, that means you didn't you still not install the Internet Information Services on your PC. I have another video to guide you how to install this service on the PC. So I will put the link in the description of this video so you can come there to take a look into the video for more detail. Okay. So now here, assuming you have installed the Internet Information Services successfully on the PC, so now here I will hosting the the, the wireframe of the Azure on the on this PC over the IIS. Okay. So now here I will open the Internet Information Services Manager. I will type in the Internet Information Services Manager. Open this one. Okay. And I right click on this side and add a website. I will type in it as true dot logo. I copy this one and paste the name into the hot name. Okay, for the physical path, I will open my drive. C drive interrupt. Yeah, you can. You can create create any folder on your PC to save the the code of the wireframe on in Azure. My Azure. Okay, and I will copy this part. I paste it to the physical part here. Okay, and as a as a field, I will give it by default. I click on I copy the name again. Okay button here. Okay. And then I will open the hot file. Hot file in the I open other folder. C drive in a window. You scroll down. System three two. Double click to open the folder. You scroll down. I have a folder e driver and etc folder. Yeah, here I have a file hot. I will open this one in the text editor on my PC. So here I'm using the Notepad plus plus. Open this one and I will scroll down. And paste the name here, and then I will copy the an IP address, the one seven one two seven point zero point zero point one. Here, this is the IP address of the local hot. I save it up. Save it. Okay. So now here I close this one, and I back to the Azure. On the Azure, you see here on the menu, I have an uh, option is share. I click on this one. Okay, and here you select the option from the drop down here. By default, we will select the publish to Azure Cloud. I have another video to guide you how to publish the project to cloud and share it to the customer before. So, if you want to see it, you can go to my uh, my YouTube channel to see it. Okay, I will select 
I will click the drop down button here and then I will select the publish locally option here okay and then this is a destination folder to save the file I click on drop button here and then I will select the folder in the pub www root and my Azure I select this folder yeah and then I will by default it will publish all of the pieces in my project if you don't want to publish all of the pieces you can select any you uncheck this one and select specific page you want to be published okay there's some note interaction you can also change the phone for the pieces okay I will click on the publish locally option. Yeah. So here an arrow has been occurred. Click submit to send arrow blah 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 here. I click on or I said it deny. Okay. You see this one is said deny. That means I cannot publish the content into that folder. Okay, let's see. I will Cancel this one and back to the this folder and trying to set the purpose. I have a sharing security. Let me try to set the permission. I public. Don't have. Every one. Let me share it again. Publish. Yeah. And you open the folder. Azure. My Azure. Yeah, you see, all of the content has been published to this folder. Okay, back to browser, and this is some of the in instruction to guide you how to view the content of the Azure project on the Chrome. Yeah, so it said here, Azure API extension. You have to install the an extension for the Azure on Chrome in order to view the content you click on this one is install extension click on add to chrome okay close this one and the next step you have to open the more tool extension and then you have to allow asset to find url okay let me see more option extension okay here it already opens the allow to accept you can open detail okay 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 ah no 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 allow access to file url open this one okay close this one close this one and here I open this back to this one and Azure root local. Yeah. So now here when I type in the Azure root local, it will open the home page for me. I click on news services product introduction home page. Okay, it is running very good. Okay, so I think that's all for today. And after you finish this video, you know how to do the hosting, the Azure project uh, in the locally. Yeah. Basically here we are hosting is underneath of the Internet Information Services. Okay. 
before you do the hosting over the Internet Information Services, you have to make sure that you have already installed the Internet Information Services successfully on your PC. Okay, I think that's all. And thank you for watching. See you later in other video. Bye-bye.